I've been staring at the charts all day and I'm struggling to understand what inverse fair value gaps are. Can you help me, bro? Okay, sure. Let's do it. Here we have a lower low, lower high, lower low, and a lower high being made. And what do we call this trend? Is it called a bearish trend? Amazing. And the thing that's resting below this lower lows is called sell side liquidity. So as we said, we have a downtrend. And here, this sell side liquidity got swept, which means that the price is giving us a reversal and the opportunity to get into a buy position. So as we said before, you're struggling to understand inverse fair value gaps. And what are basically inverse fair value gaps are fair value gaps of an opposite trend. So if we are looking to get into a buy position, into a bullish position, we need to find a bearish fair value gap that didn't get respected. So as I said before, we have a sell side liquidity that got swept, which means the price is giving us a reversal and we have a bearish fair value gap here, which didn't get respected. What does that mean? That means that the price broke above it and it's restarting back to it to give us a buy position to enter. Do you get me now? Yeah. So later on, we have an uptrend being made and here we have a bearish fair value gap that didn't get respected and the price just broke right above it. And what does it make this bearish fair value gap? An inverse fair value gap? amazing and the price is offering us a buy position right off this inverse fair value gap so if you guys didn't understand this video check my page for more videos and to understand fair value gaps more